one of the most talked about pro wrestlers on the planet, along with our very own talented and rather intimidating athletes, are about to take to the ring for SPW's annual Southern Rumble. Only one can be crowned the next contender for the SPW New Zealand Heavyweight Champion, and here to tell us what that will take. Please welcome to the cafe Dapper Agent Kingy, Dapper Agent Vinny, and TK Cooper. Hang on a sec. Hang on a sec. Everyone, quieten down. What kind of an introduction was that? You've been on TV for years and that's the best you can come up with? <laughs> Sitting here, down the end it. is TK here Cooper, one of the this. most hottest upcoming stars in the world of yeah. professional, okay. professional wrestling. Yeah. And what you're looking at here is eight New Zealand heavyweight championships between us, three tag team championships between us as well. Then <laughs> done, Kingy, the <laughs> dapper. Agents. And we are looking good. And we are looking good. I mean, we are dressed. We, we, look at it. And, and Mike, if you can't get that right, mm -hmm. there's no way you're getting a rose from us. <laughs> oh! Oh! Well. But could he maybe get a wrestling move from you? <laughs> oh, maybe? You might love. <laughs> well, wow. off to a flying start. Okay, so Dapper Agent Kingy, Dapper Agent Vinny, Dada, to Kite There you go. There you go. Right. Okay, Rodio, so tell me more about this. Uh, can, you, can you explain how the Southern Rumble works? 20 men will be in Invercargill on the 22nd of July, and mm -hmm. the ultimate prize you are going to be the last man standing. Every right. two minutes, someone's going to come in, and if your feet get thrown over the top rope and touch the floor, you are eliminated until there is one man left, and I guarantee that you're looking at the last two right here. <laughs> standing. Uh, and, 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 it, and when oh. we get to the last two, I'll just, I'll just take care of him, and I'll, I'll go in and win the belt. So, <laughs> Kingy, right, you, you guys, you sort of wrestle together, you do that... Um, Tag teaming, right? We've, we've, we've tagged all over the world. Together. So does that mean you're going to take out the competition first and then it'll just be left to you two? Yeah. Who's going to win? Man won. Uh huh. <laughs> Oh, look at that. No, no, we hug Grant here. Okay, oh, one of the legends, oh. TK Cooper. How are you? Is that better? Is that better? Is that what I'm saying? Keep working on it. Keep working on it. You want to hug me. You might have a future you wanna, kid. Right, okay. We'll fix it in post, mate. We'll fix it in post. Mate, <laughs> <laughs> it in post. Okay, TK, so what are the rules with that? When it's a rumble, are there any rules? Um, how, do, how do you get the boys out of the ring? As far as the rules for a battle royal go, it's, it's all bets are off, brother. Um, all you got to do is get the dude over the top rope, down to the floor, whatever it takes. Okay, cool. Yeah, this, the main thing is just protecting yourself, making sure you don't get thrown over yourself. Like, if you're throwing a dude over and someone comes behind you, throws you over, done. Nice, so, so no rules. That's going to be a good night then, isn't it? Eyes in the back of your head, whole time. Right, okay. So, so what's your, like, signature move? Um, well, kind of like what the clip showed, I'm a bit more of an aerial guy, but I've got these, like, got these nice long legs. I do uh -huh. a lot of kicks, a lot of kicks. Right. Keep people at bay. Uh, I get, keeping them away yeah, yeah. and getting them over. Yeah. Right, okay, fantastic. And, and you just came back from the UK, didn't you? Uh, yeah, me and um, my, my girlfriend, my partner, we just spent the last two years over in the UK. Um, it just kind of came about because uh, our goals and what New Zealand could offer at the time just weren't coming so, together. So we um, actually ended up leaving for the UK where the, uh, where the wrestling scene is... Well, yeah, we've 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 been away for the last two years now, wrestling full time every weekend. And how do we how do we stack up in New Zealand compared to the UK? There is. <laughs> oh! <laughs> See, it's too high. <laughs> Everest is too high. I, if I'm honest, Kingy is the one who trained me, and now I'm one of the stand-up performers in the world. Yeah, so man. If, you, if you need any any admission on how good we are here. Oh, I was I was I was trained by some of the best in New Zealand, and now I am one of the best in the world. And I've I I don't mean to sound arrogant, but it nah. is just the truth. Yeah. Yeah. If it's I, true, it's true. Yeah. Exactly. If it's true, it's true. I don't want to put myself on a pedestal at all, but it is just it is just the truth. I am nice. I know. I love that. No, that's good, and that's why you're here because I didn't know that. No, so there you go. Like, now humble. we do. Humble, humble. humble. totally humble. No true hobbies here. Talking about that though, humble. <laughs> Who is this guy? The aerial assassin, Will Osprey. He's a bit of a big deal, isn't he? I'll, I'll happily feel that. One as yeah. well. So um, Will is Will is a British boy. Um, he he's managed to secure himself a full time contract in Japan. So he's he's wrestling full time in Japan and England. So it's a pretty big deal in terms of as far as wrestling is concerned. Um, he's actually a buddy of mine. Uh, obviously, spending two years, I was bound to run into him surely. Literally. And, yeah. You know, so <laughs> like I've I've been around him. He's really cool. He's he's a really nice guy. And uh, New Zealand is really fortunate to have him come down and integrate into our wrestling scene and hopefully 
um, with him being here, it'll get more eyes on New Zealand, it'll get more eyes in the wrestling scene, and hopefully um, just all the boys that are coming up, but uh, the next generation of wrestlers and whatever, like, can take a little bit away from Will. He's a bit more of a high flyer, he comes off the top rope, spins around 35 times, then lands on your head, whereas we just like to punch people right in their mouth. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bit easier. Then we can all look at <laughs> <laughs> the boots. The boots. And okay. you lay the spear and it's all over. Right, I'm kidding, and we win the rumble. <laughs> so how do you rate your chances against him? Pretty good? Who? Oh, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. You're onto it. You're onto it. <laughs> right, okay. Nice work, guys. Best of luck. I learned a lot. That was I did too. Yeah, that was awesome. If you want to find out more about the SPW oh, yeah. Southern oh, yeah. Rumble, which is in Invercargill on the 22nd of July, or any of the other surrounding events, go to eventfinder.co.nz. I'm pleased we ran out of time, so I was going to say that sometimes wrestling looks like choreographed dance moves, but I was going to say it's a bit tougher than that, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. What? Yeah, that's my <laughs> <laughs> Okay, looking forward to that. Mark's going to show us the next steps to Creators Chicken and Black Bean Chowder. That's right after Holly, who is now with Martin Cooper. And I might just join you. Okay, I'll see you in a minute.